tupel 3D scanners are ready to be ordered in European Union. New unit 2,900 euros. Hello colleagues, I'm glad to reach you out because tupel 3D company have released new firmware for the scanner and the new scanning software for the computer connected to your scanner. I have installed that new software for scanning and updated the firmware on, on the dental scanner, Tupel 3D Dental, and have made same tests, same test scans, which I performed uh, on November of the last year, and I got better results. So I'll do those tests today once again. So first of all, I'll scan all in four case, this one. Uh, four multi-units directly on them. Another one, uh, direct to implants, hybrid scan bodies, a titanium interface and the top part made from peak. Also, different color, a white plaster, two implant case, two different scan bodies. One Medantica, it's a metal coated scan body and another is full peak, Strauman original. And one, I would say, a very complicated case, but still many people do it. I'll scan directly from titanium base because this one scan was most difficult for the scanner. And I have already done a few scans and I was very surprised because the result was much better. So let's have a look. How did it went a few months ago and what kind of result we can get right now? So first of all, let's check on the scan made with four multi-units. I think it's Megagan multi-units and it's wide, uniform scan bodies for them, cylindrical shape. Control scan has been made on expensive new accurate scanner, Medit T710, one of the newest from the Medit lab line. This scan was made on November. So I will make the color of it, I will make it golden brown. So it will indicate that we, this is an old scan. And the new scan will be made in color. It's PLI format. You can see the same files. So first of all, let's align the old scan. I will turn off for you the coloring so you could see, you can see the scan body scanning got much much smoother so we got better geometries we can already tell it that we got a better result just by looking to it probably let's uh, better measure it so first of all let's check the few months ago made first of my test scans not bad at all you can see that a few months ago made scan in the range of 100 microns isn't that bad. Let's change it to 50 microns to half of it. 50 microns for a lab scanner is not that accurate but still accurate enough to check if the scan is pretty well made. So even the old scan wasn't that bad. And let's check it out now. Our new scan. How does it compare with the new software updates to the old one? Well, we can see that we got much better result. The white one is closer to the accurate result. It's 26 microns error. 
and the old one is 40. You can see now we got more consistent result. Here we got even bigger difference. This golden one is a scan with a meta scanner and the white one our new test scan. As you can see the error with older software was bigger. I would say great success. At the back not that big difference from 10 microns to 7. Not bad. Let's check on our model. Now let's take the model with directly to implant scan bodies. The hi four hybrid scan bodies with titanium interfaces and the peak top part. So let's make it like the last time. Let's load first the old model. I'll make the color golden brown, similar to last time. something like that and let's load the new scan with textures yep I think I got the right model yes as you can see it's that model let's check how accurate now we have got that scan First of all, let's align the old model. As you can see, it's more trashy with the algorithms and the filtering. It's not that great as on the new scans. And here we go. So the fitting of the model is not that bad. Now we have the color mapping, the heat mapping in the 50 microns range, the same as on the previous model. This is the old scan. As you can see with the scan but it's not that great result. Well let's see. If the new scan is not only better looking but also more accurate. I think it should be quicker probably because we don't have that base plate I selected uh, for the base plate to be cut away automatically well it looks that the model at least that's for sure it's more accurate with the scan bodies it's probably a little bit more accurate but not so magic as I was probably probably expecting so we can check it right now. Saving a few microns for us. Yep, older scans not that accurate. So this is how it looks like on a scanner for 15,000 euros. Well, we have to agree. It's, the result is good. Old scan with the old software on Tupel 3D. As you can see, those titanium bases are not so nice. Nope. And let's now import the old scan from November of titanium bases with the Tupel 3D with older scan software and older firmware. So let's import the old scan. These are the eight scans with eight different settings and I think the number four was pretty much okay. Much better than the other ones. I'll make the color golden brown like the other. 
test scans. Okay, as you can see, compared to expensive scanner, more difficult to use such scan. Okay, and the new scan will be somewhere, somewhere. A few moments later. My bad, guys. I haven't got, I probably deleted, so I'll scan it again. Just right now. Yep. I have noticed that now you can leave the exposure and you still get the good result. So, okay, it took me around two minutes for the basic scan. I'll probably add some additional scans to make it better. Oh well, it should be okay. Let's check it out. So this is comparison with Medit T710. The white one is scan with tuple 3D. The golden brown is older scan. As we can see, it's much more accurate compared to Medi-Scan. Let's check it out, the model with two scan bodies. The Medit Expensive Scanner Base Scan for reference model and the new scans i think i made two of them and this is the old model with the scan plate as you can see i'll make the color like always golden brown and let's try to position it This is a medit scan. This is shining expensive one model scan. As you can see sharp edges, nice. This is new scan with tuple. Another new scan with tuple with different settings. The white one, I like it more. This is the original scan body geometry from library. And this is the old scan. This is the old scan. This is the new scan. This is the old scan. This is the new scan from yesterday. Well, you can see it yourself. Let's check the scan bodies. The white one is the new scan. And this is the old scan.
old scan, new scan. This is a new scan. This is an old scan. And the greenish is the second new scan. As you can see, scan quality became better. That's all folks. I hope guys you find my videos interesting and now you know a little bit more about what kind of capabilities are working uh, with tuple 3d dental scanner i would not recommend making direct to implant titanium bars only on multi-units of course you can try on two or four implants on some uh, more uh, tolerant systems uh, but for example working on titanium basis i think tuple 3d scanner is enough even for the bridges if you would like you can order scanner directly from me it would be beneficial for guys uh, working and living in european union i could sell it for you for a company invoice for 2900 euros also the first unit which I got, the demo unit, is also available for the guys who would like to get the scanner faster. That scanner would cost you 2,600 euros. If you agree on standard shipping around 5-7 working days in continental Europe, if you're not living somewhere deep, far away in the mountains or small islands, somewhere in the Atlantic Ocean, the shipping would cost you nothing it would be included in the price. But of course, if you're living some distant, hard to reach area, we would need to agree on some extra payment. Of course, you may offer also your shipping company. If you would like to get it in one or two working days with express delivery, it will cost you additional money. Also, we got one demo unit for 2600 euros and if any one of you would like to get the scanner in the upcoming week in a few days after paying the company invoice via bank it is possible until of course that unit is not booked by someone else and of course if you are living somewhere in ireland or british islands or making order from united states from iceland it is the best for you to order directly from Tuple 3D. So let me know if you would like to order the scanner to get a demo or a new unit and I'll send you form to fill in to get an invoice. If you would like to see some more information you can watch the old video. You can find a link and to watch the unboxing and the testing of the scanner. If you will need any more details please write me a letter or just leave a comment. See you guys, bye! Tupel 3D scanners are ready to be ordered in European Union. New unit 2900 euros.